In this presentation, we will take a look at multiple choice questions related to budgeting, going through the question, and then practicing test taking skills with them. First question, the normal budget period is A, 260 working days, B, monthly period broken out into daily budgets, C, a quarterly period broken out into weekly budgets, D, an annual period broken out into weekly budgets, and E, an annual period broken out into quarterly and monthly budgets. Let's go through this again using the process of elimination. The normal budget period is A, 260 working days. Uh, that seems like an odd kind of period. I think they got that number actually by saying if there were five work days times 52 weeks, that would be the 260, but that seems still doesn't seem normal. And then B says monthly period broken out into daily budgets. So a monthly period, a monthly, eh, I'll keep it for now. C says a quarterly period broken out into weekly budgets. Again, you can say eh, quarterly, eh. D says an annual budget, an, an annual period broken out into weekly periods. So annual is what I would kind of expect. I would think annual. So I'll keep that for now. And then E says an annual period broken out into quarterly and monthly budgets. And that's the one that seems most normal because it's you've got a, an annual period, that which seems like what it would be. And then it broke it out into the next component, which would be quarters into force. That seems normal. And then monthly period. So I would think of all these, E seems the most reasonable if I go back through this. I don't think it's because you're not going to make a monthly budget each month, we're probably going to make a yearly budget. We're probably not going to make a quarterly budget. We're going to make a yearly budget. We're not going to make an annual budget and then break it out into weeks without first breaking it out into quarters and then months. We don't make an annual budget and then break it out into 52 weeks. Typically, we usually make an annual budget, break it out into quarterlies, and then break it out into months. So I think the final answer then will be